Hello everyone and welcome. Today I am encouraging you to take care of yourself as you would your cell phone. Say what? So hi, my name is Sue Ann Hickey. I'm a certified naturopath and creator of Body Typology, System for Lasting Weight Loss. So what helpin happens if you don't plug in your cell phone? It dies, right? So what about yourself? If you don't give yourself time to recharge, then you will maybe not die, but you won't function very well. So I really encourage you to take the time to get some downtime for yourself, to make sure that you recharge your batteries often. Now there are different body types that have different needs. I just got off a call recently with a gonad body type, also known as the pear body type, and she was so happy when I told her that her body type needs more sleep than any of the other four body types. She was like, yay! <laughs> she was so happy to know that she could get extra sleep and that was really good for her because she'd been trying to stay up late. I had a woman who was 71 years old who, when I told her that she could be sleeping more, she's like, oh, I always felt guilty about sleeping more. So please banish that thought. Do not feel guilty if you need more sleep, especially if you're a pear shaped or gonad body type, you definitely need more sleep. That helps you feel good, recharges your energy. If you're an adrenal body type, you might need to be more careful about managing your stress because the adrenal body type tend to have this underneath, underlying, interiorizing stress that's going on and they really need to manage that stress and also their body might hold on to the weight if they're in this high level of stress all the time. So what can you do to better manage your stress? Can you go for a walk? Listen to music, do some yoga, meditation, talk to a girlfriend, have a bath, anything you can do to recharge your battery, recharge yourself is so beneficial. Now imagine if you were given one cell phone for your whole life. You'd pretty take pretty good care of it, wouldn't you? You'd make sure that it was going to be okay. So we are given this one body for our whole life. What can you do to ensure you have a healthy body that's going to last a long time and not have a lot of aches and pains and health issues as you grow older? Many people don't think of that, myself included. I joined a cycling club and for 13 years, I did a lot of cycling, like most people would find it excessive, but it was my passion. And you think, well, I'm exercising, it's good for me, right? Mm. So if you're in this position and that's hard on the neck for hours and hours every day, you might get some disc degeneration in your neck like I have. So I have to be careful with uh, making sure I go to the osteopath and making sure I take care of my body, take supplements to increase the collagen and things like that to ensure that that won't give me any pain or grief further down the road. So I encourage you to look at what's going on now. Don't wait until later. Some, so many people there may, might say, I wish I didn't have to take all this medication, but if you think of it in advance when you're younger, you can easily alleviate the, the need for medication in my opinion. So I'm encouraging you to jump on the bandwagon, eat as healthy as you can, move your body, but not <laughs> excessively in one repetitive movement, get lots of variety. And if you need help, if you want to drop the pounds, by all means, reach out. I'd love to jump on a 20 minute free discovery call to show you how you can completely transform your life and your health by nourishing your body with healthy foods, eating right for your body type, and healing the emotional issues that are there as well. So the link will be either above or below, or maybe in my bio, depending on which platform you're watching this in. Book your free discovery call and let's chat. Have a great day and thanks for watching.